Hi guys, in this video we are going to learn how to draw flowchart to find given number palindrome number or not. Here we have to find given number palindrome or not. What is palindrome? Palindrome is a number. It remains same when its digits are reversed. Got it? If the number is 1, 2, 3, 2, 1. When it reversed means it will 1, 2, 3, 2, 1. It remains same, right? So it is called as a palindrome number. Here we are going to draw flowchart. What is flowchart? Flowchart is a graphical representation of solved problem. Flowchart is always start with start statement. It is writing within an oval shape. Next step, we have to read a input values. Input values is always writing within a parallelogram shape. Within that we have to read n. Here we have to find given number, right? We have, here we have to read a number that is n. Next step. Next step we have to declare temp and reverse value. Declaration is always done within a rectangular shape. Within that we have to declare temp value is equal to n and reverse is equal to 0. Here we have to declare temp is equal to n and initially reverse is equal to 0. Next, next we have to start calculation. Next we have to find reminder. REM, this variable indicate reminder. REM N modulo 10. N modulo 10. Next we have to find reverse value. reverse rev reverse is equal to to find reverse value formula is reverse into 10 plus reminder rem next step next step we have to find again we have to find n value that is n is equal to n divided by 10 next next step we have to check if n greater than 0 or not comparison is always done within a diamond shape if n greater than 0 if this condition is true we have to again repeat this calculation this process got it see here here if n value is equal to 141 First, we have to find here temp is we have to declare temp is equal to 141 and reverse is initially reverse is equal to 0. Here we have to find a reminder. Reminder is equal to 141 modulo 10. What is the reminder here? 1, right? Next, we have to find reverse value. What is the reverse for, to find reverse value? Reverse into 10. Initially, reverse is equal to 0. 0 into 10 plus reminder that is 1. It becomes 1 reverse is equal to 1 next we have to find n value n is equal to n divided by 10 n value is 141 divided by 10 so n value become 14 next we have to check if n value greater than 0 right here n value is 14 so greater than 0 again it will repeat the same process that is reminder is equal to again we have to calculate reminder n value is changes to 14 right 14 modulo 10 here reminder is 4 next we have to calculate reverse value reverse into 10 what is the value of reverse here 1 right 1 into 10 reverse value is changes to 1 right so here we have to replace reverse is equal to in is equal to 1 1 into 10 plus what is the value of reminder that is 4 1 into 10 10 plus 4 14 next we have to calculate n value n is equal to n divided by 10 what is the value of n that is 14 right 14 divided by 10 n value become 1 next we again we have to calculate if so we have to compare if n value greater than 0 n value is 1 right 1 is greater than 0 so again we have to continue this process again reminder is equal to n modulo 10 what is the value of n 1 1 modulo 10 is equal to 1 reminder become 1 next we have to calculate reverse value reverse what is the value of reverse it become 14 right 14 into here yeah. 
अपडेट अपडेट है रिवर्स वैल्यू इज़ फोर्टीन सो फोर्टीन इंटू टेन प्लस रिवर्स रिमाइंडर इज़ वन वन फोर्टी प्लस वन इट बिकम वन फोर्टी वन रिवर्स वैल्यू बिकम वन फोर्टी वन अगेन वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट एन वैल्यू व्हाट इज़ द वैल्यू ऑफ एन इट इज वन राइट वन डिवाइडेड बाई टेन इट बिकम जीरो इफ एन वैल्यू ग्रेटर देन जीरो इट इज इक्वल राइट एन वैल्यू इज जीरो सो इट कम आउट ऑफ इट विल गोज टू फॉल्स स्टेटमेंट नेक्स्ट स्टेप नेक्स्ट स्टेप वी हैव टू कम इफ temp is equal to reverse here temp is equal to reverse what is the value of temp here temp value is 141 right what is the value of reverse here reverse value is also 141 it is equal right if it is true We have to print if it is if this condition is true. We have to print palindrome number. If this condition is false, we have to print. output value is always writing within the parallelogram shape not palindrome if this condition is false temp is equal to reverse finally we have to combine these two statement with stop statement stop statement is used to stop flowchart stop statement is writing within a oval shape so guys this is the flow chart to find give a number palindrome number or not first we it is start with star statement it is writing within a oval shape next we have to read n value it is writing within a <coughs> input value it is writing within a parallelogram shape next we have to declare temp is equal to n and reverse is equal to 0 declaration is done within a rectangular shape next we have to calculate remind rem rem that indicate reminder is equal to n modulo 10 next we have to Calculate reverse is equal to reverse into ten plus reminder. Next we have to calculate n is equal to n divided by ten. Here calculation is done within a rectangular shape. Next we have to check compare. That is done within a diamond shape. If n greater than zero, if this condition is true, it will repeat the process. This calculation. In case this condition is false, we have to check if temp is equal to reverse. If this condition is true, we have to print. Palindrome number. If this condition is false, we have to print not palindrome. Finally, we have to stop the flowchart using stop statement. Here, stop and uh, sorry, start and stop statement writing within a oval shape. Next, input and output values writing within a parallelogram shape. Calculation and declaration writing within a rectangular shape. Comparison is done within a diamond shape. This is the flowchart to find given number palindrome or not. If you like my video, please like and subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching. All the best.